Little League is a rite of passage for many kids, and it wouldn't be possible without lots of dedicated volunteers. Tess Van Stratton shows us how Beacon Hill baseball and softball volunteers are making a difference in this week's Vital People. Change up, right? We got the slider. Oh, yeah, the slider. That's right. Tack Nikitas has been a Little League volunteer for almost a quarter of a century. I love it. It, it kind of brings me back to being a youth and, uh, you know, I played here as a kid and uh, my kids went through the park and I just feel like I owe it to the community to be here. Any other uh, pitches that you guys know? Tack started volunteering with Beacon Hill Baseball when his kids were playing and never left. Well, I did say in 2017 that I was going to stop volunteering, but I kind of got dragged back in. People needed me and I said, sure, if they, you need me, I'll be here. And Tack isn't the only longtime volunteer at Beacon Hill, which has been fielding players since 1957. You know, we have a, a few volunteers that have been doing this for, for two decades, going on three decades, um, and it's amazing how many people's lives they've touched. Um, so for those people who have committed a large portion of their own life uh, to creating positive uh, you know, influences in, in others, it touches your heart. Coaches, please gather your teams so you're all together. The Beacon Hill Baseball and Softball Association has more kids playing ball this year than ever before. 525 plus players and 43 teams and it wouldn't be possible without dozens of volunteers on the field and off. But we also ask our parents and our community members to volunteer almost daily so really this is participation for everybody so once you're involved you are really involved. Baseball dad David Berkovitz is definitely very involved coaching not one but two little league teams this year. It's a lot better than watching kids play video games so it's Getting out here and playing ball and being a team is awesome. Teamwork's one of the biggest lessons kids learn here, and it goes far beyond the diamond. You have to get along with other other people, and uh, you know, through life, uh, through jobs, uh, you have to get along with the people that you work with. You're working together for one goal, and I think it's the best thing for kids to learn. So what do we do? Try our best, be a good sport, and have fun. And for all the volunteers that make it possible, nothing is more rewarding. So this is a not-for-profit um, uh, organization, and uh, no one is paid. We're all doing this uh, for the fun of it, and uh, and really the pay is to see all the smiles on all those players' faces. I just think if uh, you want your community to be strong, uh, I think it, that's something that everybody should do. Volunteering, there's nothing better than doing it. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.